Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to challenge number five in a playthrough series of Magic the Gathering. Today, I feel a lust for blood. Lust for blood. And, uh, yeah, I don't really have anything to say except here we go. And I will skip it, skip it, skip it. Uh, and uh, if you're new to this, don't skip that. <laughs> it's kind of important if you haven't played this game before. And uh, yeah, this got four creatures, and I got one creature. It might look quite dark for me, but if you look at my creature, it's got flying, death touch, lifelink, and an equipment that gives it first strike, vigilance, trample, and haste. So this guy is a tough, badass motherfucker. And uh, I obviously have to block this guy because I have 8 health and it will do 8 damage to me. And uh, now we are thinking, well, he's only got 4 damage and 3 toughness. Won't he die? No, I won't. Because... If you look at this guy, first of all, it's got death touch, which means uh, if I deal damage to a creature, it will die. No matter how, how little damage I do, if I deal one damage, I will kill anything I hit. And I also have a first strike, once again. So when I block this guy, I will hit him first, he will die due to death touch, and he won't be able to hit me. As you see there, he's dead. And now it's my turn, I will just play this card. And I will attack them. And uh, yeah, he will obviously block me with all three of these guys. But when someone blocks you, you can assign the damage and the game does it for you. One damage to each of the spiders. And uh, it's death touch, so all of the spiders will die. And then I got one damage over, which will go to his health, as I have Trample. So, they all die, he dies, and you won. Thank you for watching, and as always, this is Muckletuff here, a Muckletuff production. I would like to thank you for watching, and I will see you in challenge number 6. Goodbye.